the Rolls-Royce Phantom, Mercedes-Benz Maybach and Bentley Mulsanne. All cars with six-figure price tags and operated by chauffeurs with, shall we say, a certain type of clientele. Reserved for the super rich, these limousines transport clients in first-class luxury and put your standard long wheelbase chauffeur saloon to shame with their extravagant five-star interiors. For this film, we are going to concentrate on the smallest of the bunch, the Bentley Flying Spur. The Flying Spur has been in the marketplace since 2005, and you could say it's the baby of the bunch due to its starting price of a mere 155 grand. But weighing in at 2.5 tonnes and measuring 5.2 metres in length, the Flying Spur is certainly no super mini when it comes to its sheer size. It was refreshed in 2014 when it received a 40% reduction in cabin noise and a much greater focus on the rear seat passenger with new touchpad controls and enhanced interactivity. With this update came a V8 model offering lower running costs. However, this is the W12 6 litre model and it's not a vehicle for the fuel conscious driver as every glance reveals a significant change in the fuel gauge. But when you have 800 newton meters of torque and 620 brake under your foot, this isn't very surprising. It'll be no shock to report this engine is an engineering marvel. It's smooth, progressive, and a perfectly tuned yet subtle rumble from the exhaust lets your client know that he's travelling in something quite special, and certainly won't be late for his meeting at the Ivy. In motorway driving conditions, the superb W12 shuts down six of its cylinders to increase fuel consumption resulting in around 20 miles per gallon, which certainly isn't bad when you start taking everything into consideration. Just when you thought a vehicle costing more than £150,000 would have everything, Bentley kindly fitted just under £40,000 worth of options to our test car. These included a Mulliner driving specification, which gives the interior an extra special finish, and an extra special cost of £13,000 and a rather stunning bottle cooler between the rear seats with bespoke crystal champagne flutes costing more than your average fridge at seven and a half grand. The rear seats of the Flying Spur is certainly the place to be, which is a bonus as, dare I say it, typical Skoda VW MMI software is the only thing that lets this car down. Overall, the Flying Spur is a beautiful, great looking car with tons of road presence a luxury that anyone could really need. It's certainly the more economical option when it comes to super limos without having an economical feel about it. It may not have the latest state-of-the-art technological gimmicks you may find in its German rivals, but it doesn't matter, it's a Bentley. And a Bentley customer wouldn't want those anyway. Mm -hmm.